Hi, my name is Daniel Platt, and today I want to answer the question of where are your Nginx files located? Now, it can be a bit daunting trying to find your Nginx files because they don't always live in the same place. Granted, on most computers, you'll find them in slash etc slash Nginx. But what if they're not? How do you find them? Well, I think the easiest way to find them is by typing in the command nginx. And you can specify dash t to test your nginx config. And that will tell you exactly where your nginx files live. So on Mac, using brew, my nginx files actually live somewhere completely different than when you normally find them somewhere else. So let's try that on Ubuntu. Oh, well, I have a warning in my config, but you can see that these ones live in the standard place of forward slash etc forward slash nginx. And your main config file is nginx.conf. But what about all your other config files? I've seen multiple setups. So let's have a quick look at what we've got. So on brew, let's quickly type this in. We've got a folder called servers, but on Ubuntu, we don't have that. We actually have something called sites enabled and sites available. And that's just so you can turn them on and off without actually deleting the config. It's using sim links. And there's a third way where they use conf.d where all your server files are live in there. Well, you can, how do you know which one of these setups you've got? Well, you can kind of figure it out by looking, but also if you look at the end of uh, nginx.conf, oh, I'm in the, I should have changed directory rather than just looked in it. Uh, it's not right at the end then. There's a line in here called include, and that will just include all the config files. And you can see, you can see here that this one's using conf.d.conf. And I think what's happened is I like the sites enabled format, so I recreated it. If we were to try the same thing on the Mac, we should be able to see that as well. And let's not make the same mistake again. And it's nginx.conf. And this one you can see the include servers forward slash star. So that's just a quick way of finding your config files on whichever server you're using.